milk all over his face. Say hi! <laughs> Today, I wanted to share with you guys my breastfeeding journey. As you all know, my sweet baby boy is now 14 months, and I recently just finished breastfeeding. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. I'm so happy to be done. I'm so happy that he doesn't depend on me anymore to go to sleep. I'm just so happy to be done. However, it was a great time. You got me He isn't to talk to not a happy that the boy. It was a great experience while it lasted. I'm very happy that I did it. I will be doing it with my future children. And I take it back to the world. I loved the bond that it created between me and him. And I love that he got all his nutrients from me and I didn't have to go outside and buy baby food because now that I have to, Jaden, you're getting a little bit expensive. I have a few things written down so that I don't get off track so we can go ahead and jump right into it. Well, I just stopped breastfeeding at 13 months. One of the reasons that I breastfed him for so long is that he was allergic to formula. He would um, end up throwing it up and he took one formula which is the Gerber Good Start Gentle. A lot of moms are familiar with it because that's one of the ones that the doctors recommend when you're trying to get your baby onto formula. Took that for about a week and then we tried to give it to him again and his stomach just wasn't having it so we had to I had to keep on breastfeeding milk supply never really went down I had to drink mother's milk tea in order to keep the supply up for a while as long as you drink water and have a healthy diet you tend to produce as much milk as you need for your child another thing that I wanted to talk about which I know a lot of you moms hate about breastfeeding is engorgement you first experience it after you give birth you have bricks on your body it is very painful to deal with it you can take a Motrin or a Tylenol you experience engorgement again as your body is getting used to your child's schedule and when they would like to eat. Oh, you experience it when you're going through any changes. You also have to go through it one more time when you're trying to dry your milk up. I had to go through that. I went two days without feeding him and like seriously, it hurts so bad. I gave it and I fed him but since I had waited so long to feed him, my book ended up going on its merry way anyway. You do have to be careful when trying to dry up your milk or trying to switch your child's schedule because you may end up like me and getting mas mastitis. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's basically when your milk gets stuck up here and it won't let down. And it is the most painful thing ever. Feel the milk ducts all up here. He caught it enough time. He told he told me how to, um, my doctor told me how to, you know, help soothe it. Jaden just sucked it on out. It's not any disease or anything that's gonna harm your child. It's just the fact that the milk, for some reason, had gotten stuck. Like, for example, my doctor said it could have been the way that I slept. As of right now, you see that Jaden's hand is in my shirt. I'm trying to end that, okay? But apparently after breastfeeding, he's deciding like, okay, well if I can't suck on it, I'm gonna have my hand on it. Look at him trying to creep down there, Jaden. And he even does it to his father. I don't know what his fascination is with it. I don't know if it's because he was breastfed for so long and I know that babies like to twiddle the other nipple as they're nursing for comfort. As you can see, he gets very angry and then tries to creep back down there. I know you guys may be wondering, since I am not breastfeeding him anymore, what have I switched him to? Well, I've purchased these little bottles. As you can see, he has sucked it dry already and I've filled it up three times today. A little bit of vitamin D milk, also known as whole milk. That is what I'm giving him now, as well as regular human, not human food, or food, you know, like table food. Every morning I give him waffles. I used to give him waffles and Nutella, but now I give him waffles and butter because he eats that more. And I get him the little mini waffles where it'll be like there's four waffles in one. I get him that and I break it up. He'll eat all eight of them. I'll give him a banana and I buy him the little graduates toddler meal. As far as when we go out to eat, we do order him his own food. However, for some reason, I don't know if it's because he's uncomfortable being in such a loud public area, he will not eat in public. As far as snacks go, I try to give him healthy snacks so they have like the little baby rice rusk. So like I said, I'll give him a banana or something like that. And he does eat that. The only thing that I will honestly say that he gets disgusted by is greens. So we're gonna have to work on that. Jaden, get your hand out of my shirt. Get it out of my shirt. Get it out of my shirt. The thing that helped with the, with the transition <laughs> is 
these little babies right here this is the mom brand pacifiers the reason I got this brand is because he has four teeth now and the little ridge on the nipple his teeth sit right there and it really soothes him <laughs> all of my young breastfeeding moms out there I know that it's frustrating and I know you may want to give up at times but I promise you it all pays off in the end it is such a beautiful experience with your child it's a bond like no other and you will not regret it after doing it I promise you <laughs> if you have any other questions or anything that you would like to ask me please don't hesitate to comment or shoot me a text or hit me up on snapchat hit me up and i will help you with anything you need advice with that was my breastfeeding journey again i breastfed for 13 months i feel accomplished i feel proud because now my baby boy got everything that he needs to start his little life thank you guys for listening to my story i hope that it helps some of you young mothers out there don't forget to like and subscribe this video and i'll see you all in the next one bye you say bye 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 baby can you say bye bye